Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Great White & Co. My name is Sri, and today I'm joined by Austin and Alexa for our live watch-along of the very first State of Play of 2021. It seems that Thursday Ooh. at 5 p.m. EST is just but everyone wants to drop the hot news. So here we are again, this time for a 30-minute conference, not a 50-minute one. And from what I heard, it's apparently 10 games that we're going to be hearing from, and they're... I don't think there's any announcements. I think it's just updates and information on already announced titles. So, considering that I've, you know, nailed the last prediction during the Nintendo Direct that we will not hear anything about Breath of the Wild 2. Whoa, 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 whoa. whoa Hold whoa, on. Whoa. We did hear something okay. about Breath of the Wild 2. It's just that it's still... All right, Austin, were your, socks, were your socks on? <laughs> were your socks on or off? That's what I want to know. Uh, the last conference, it was... It they're, was they're on, it was so I, I'm, I, am, I, I stand corrected. I, I mean, I don't stand corrected. Sky, Skyward Sword was good. Was it was, but your there. socks were just, you know... And plus, you know, Strategy Project Triangle, or whatever. <laughs> Project <laughs> Triangle Strategy. Working title. Go. Demo. That's yeah. the full title. Um, anyway. And Mario Golf. Uh, and we're going to start off... Well, the, the, I'm not saying there were any good games. That was my prediction was specifically that we were not going to get updates on Breath of the Wild 2. And they said, hey, we welcome did. to Breath of the Wild 2. We're not going to talk about it. That's not necessarily an update. That's yeah, an I guess. update. They we were updated out. that it's still we're, happening. Yeah, we were oh, updated okay. that they're not ready to give any sort of announcements at this time. Perfect. Perfect. I see where, you're I see where your ground stands. Um, but anyway, I wanted to start with my prediction. This conference, which is that one... We're going to be seeing Horizon 2 Forbidden West, probably some sort of extended gameplay preview of some sort. And then two, uh, I think we'll probably see a little bit of Returnal, because I think that comes out next month. If I'm not... If I'm not I thought it was correct. June. Was it June? Did they push it? it? It comes out soon. In the next few months, it comes out. So I think we'll see Returnal here. Um, now, initially, I said that God of War would be here. I April, don't... April 30th, you were right. Oh, sweet. Um, I don't think God of War's here, because uh, Corey Barlog on... Twitter tweeted that he had no idea this this state of play was happening. So oh. <laughs> unless Could his PR team unless his yeah. PR team's just pulling a fast one on him, I don't think we're gonna see God of War here. Maybe maybe they'll do that little teaser like one more thing and you know, the PlayStation thing that they kind of love to do. And they'll have like a have a little Boy Are you hungry? Or whatever the hell it is. Uh, what is it? Boy your mother taught you to hunt. Yes, that that thing. Yeah, but um, mm -hmm. I don't think we'll see God of War here. What about what I about agree. you, Austin? What was your predictions? Uh, Among Us to PS4, PS5 is that'd be, that'd be good. Oh, yeah. I mean, it's coming to Xbox. I, so. I can see that. Oh, here it is. I, uh, I actually, do you have anything? Big thing. Uh, and Horizon Zero Dawn, I agree with God of War. I agree with. I don't think we hear anything. Mm -hmm. Alexa, I wish that we would get to see some stuff for uh, Hogwarts Legacy, but I know it's not a PlayStation exclusive. But the last, the first trailer we got was during a PlayStation. That's true. That's true. There's some very unexpected developments in your future. Shocking events that will change oh, crash. the course okay. of your life. <laughs> that last part might By the way, the audio is going to be low but for the stream because well, well, I don't want to get copyrighted. But also, PlayStation um. It's mainly about the discussion. If you want to watch it, I'd recommend watching it on the actual PlayStation stream and then coming back and hearing our thoughts on it. That includes 4K at 60 frames per second, Whoa. adaptive triggers, 3D audio, and more. Let's make this fun. Picking up where Crash Bandicoot Warp left off. I like that it already has like a solid amount of dislikes. We find the evil masterminds Neo Cortex and Doctor Entropy. I mean, it has like 250, so it's the ratio is good. They got mostly like giant holes in the universe. What follows is a mind. Also, shout out to Alexa for making that little uh promo window. Now we don't have to have like awkwardly shit put our website there. We're making upgrades, people. Upgrades. I was always curious what that little box was in the corner. I never knew. If I'm being honest. I think it's supposed to be for like face cam, probably. Yeah, I think it's what it is. No, no, no. I'm saying I don't know what what it was. Like when we were streaming. Oh, it's just the website. Yeah, never knew that. I like oh no, not, oh no. It was only the website when we streamed um, Nintendo Direct. Um, when we stream regularly on the weekends. Um, it's music, right? Yeah, it's music. What music? Oh, okay. So I was right. Hold on tight when you feel the boost. I, so, obviously, uh, if you have a uh, state of... Feel the sun oh, not, what's up? Um, you have PS Plus, you, you get the PS Plus collection, and this game is part of it, right? 
No, this is uh, the new one that just came out. This is Crash 4, uh, about time. Well, I, everyone has the Crash collection or whatever. The, the insane trilogy, sorry. Yeah, there it is, I keep forgetting and Austin pretend keeps correcting me. Pretend you're cultured. I'll do the from the best. Um, I just don't know if I'm up for it. Cards to track uh, I don't think it's... Crash? You're not a big Crash fan? For things like time it's fun, it's just that I don't know if I'm insane enough, you know, to oh, boss fights. Mm. I bet Entropy wishes he had that. Yeah, considering you don't even know the name of the game. Save over or the PlayStation yeah. 4. Not, you're not insane enough. To get to you just make the same joke that I did. You just repeat my joke to me. If you own the PS4 I was agreeing that you're game, not. An upgrade option is available. Check out the PlayStation That's so aesthetically pleasing. Details. Their little state of play. Whether it's your first playthrough or your hundredth, there's no better time to experience Crash Bandicoot 4. It's about time on PlayStation 5. There you go, March 12th, PS5 upgrade. Nice. I'm not writing about back, it. Crash. The gang's all here on today's new edition of State of Play. Feels weird not having We've to like... some great updates lined up for you. Oh, you go. First, let's check out the latest on an eagerly anticipated game oh, coming no, to the PS5 what game console is this? Do we know? this spring. Return. Return. Yep, I nailed it. Uh, this yeah. was a... This hey, is a game that I'm we at Housemark are excited thinking about and grabbing. It looks cool, yeah. Returnal. In Return. Housemark makes some good games, but this is very different, but I know. From Crash their regular games. Alien planet, what Metroplus. other games have they made? After receiving a mysterious I don't think signal, White Shadow. Know them. Um, they made. The players will explore this inscrutable uh, uh, dark planet. Well, it's like. Search for oh, dude, it's a space game. Oh, mysteries. it's gonna mess, mess with me. Which may point to a larger force uh, play. Dead Space. <laughs> no. This looks it's like hard. alien something. Alien. Way above and around enemies is key to oh, is it the one that's on Game Pass? No, they they they're. Uh, I'm pretty sure there's a PlayStation. Oh. They made Rezo gun. Alienation, that's what it is. Alienation. Mm. Dead Nation? <laughs> what? They made Dead Nation. Yes, they did. No, but I'm, I was talking about Alienation. Is that a large was variety of enemies and to. the vast number of unique movesets each possess? Combat situations. Yeah, this what like usually their games are not like this third person action. Death. Games. Yeah, they're they're more like cart uh, not cartoony, but like arcadey. Yeah. Mm. Okay. This looks really hard. I'm sure they're playing Every on like the you harder difficulty. Restart, the world will change. Hopefully. You think that, that but will be different. Enemies will appear in new locations and in differing numbers. So you have to think fast. Only difficult yeah. games. Here you can see the use Curse of the gods, uh, which is great for crowd control. I'm glad you picked this up that. Good. I'll stick with my easy games that I suck at. <laughs> <laughs> Took me a couple hours to beat the first boss in Curse of the Good Gods. <laughs> But I like this so far. It looks good. You will stumble I don't know if mysterious I, devices that I don't know if I, I would pay full price for it These will based off of weapons, like what I'm seeing right now, but and upgrades. <laughs> I would like to watch Siri play it and make fun and of him even though I wouldn't be able to play it. Go so get my ass kicked. Yeah. I'll play it. I'll play it. And then you guys can. We can comment on you and make fun of you. It really feels like it's like um piece together the puzzle that is the story of Selene. As they venture deeper and deeper, I hate to make comparisons all the time to like. Personal nightmare. Well, this sounds like this other game that's pretty popular, but it feels like it's like that a. Can't be here. I think I am reliving my memories in that Dark Souls-ish type of thing, Don't but like with, with guns. They're corroded. Some parts mm. are missing. Others There's some games like that already. Remnant. That's what it is. Oh, it's first person now. I can remember the torment, first feeling person. like I was losing my mind. I first person. They were like, like the, you were looking through her helmet. Oh, she's a headless ghost. Oh, oh, I'm watching oh. it in, in a tab by myself. Yeah, I know. Uh, was, so, were, so were we, but... Oh. Yeah, we're watching the we're well ahead. I'm always the farthest behind. <laughs> we're well ahead. <laughs> yeah. Oh, maybe you guys should refresh. Turtle. Returnal lands on April 30th. Oh, uh, this is that. By the talented team at House Knockout. Oh, yeah, I remember we saw this in the Nintendo, Nintendo one. Right. Oh. So let's take a closer yeah. look at a high impact made by EA? PS4 game called Knockout oh. City. Dodgeball. This would be pretty fun to play like, actually, a little it's, bit it's of, funny, like, um, putting a lot of hours. I was trying to remember this, the name of this game. And uh, pretty much right after Hi, the Nintendo I'm Direct Josh happened, we got a press release in our We're email saying, hey, check out Knockout City. I was like, oh, that works out. A team based multiplayer action game for PS4. Yeah, this, this is going to be a uh, with epic Destruction All Stars esque 
game. You see the thing, um, yeah, so Destruction, um, uh, Destruction All Stars was originally listed as a seventy dollar game. Yeah, then, my, bro my brother originally pre-ordered it for Christmas, and I told him don't do that. Hmm. Well, so and then, so hello, Camaro, welcome, welcome. So it was a seventy dollar game they put out, and then it got um. It obviously became free to play when it got delayed uh, for a limited time, and now it's twenty dollars. Wait, Destruction All Stars is twenty dollars? Yeah, because in April, and after April, it ends like it's no longer free. Hi. Hey, beautiful and hey, Alexa. I think awesome. Who's he talking about? I think it's I think it's me. I always assume it's me, but we'll see. I don't know. Well, last time didn't he say last he was like mad at you or something? I forget. I forget. There was some there was some conflict. I feel like there was some conflict. I probably wasn't even on the last stream, was I? Oh yes, I was. I dreamed late. Yes, baby doll. Wait, that doesn't clear up anything. It's me. He's playing mind games. I think that's what it is. No, it's me. All right, all right. I'll give it to you. But um, you don't have to give it to me. It's me. All right, I'll, I'll give it to you. Um, so it's in. I broke up with three for a couple weeks. See? Told you. Damn. Um. But yeah, so after April, it's no longer free. And the land in a huge instant KO explosion. For PS Plus members. I would never pay. So it's twenty dollars now. So it's fifty dollars less than what they initially thought. Also, I haven't played. It. I haven't paid attention to a single thing they're saying here. No, I wasn't listening at all. It looks nice. Wait, there's cross crossplay though, so that's pretty good. See you soon, brawlers. It's crossplay beta. Chimera's asking you questions, Austin. Uh, you and me gonna jiggy? <laughs> Don't you dare say no to daddy. First off, I'm daddy. Okay, relax. Time for God, something. Hey, he Did you say your mom? Your first look at an upcoming Did I say my mom? You, you said you're the mom. <laughs> so, <laughs> <laughs> what is this? Oh, is this oh, Tokyo? God. No, it's not. Mira said that their fish gave birth to babies, then ate them all. Oh, so Jesus. What, what, kind of, what kind of it fish happens. do you have? What yeah, what kind of other fish? fish? I can only rescue a few of them. Well, at least you gotta rescue some. Interesting. How many do you rescue? What's this game? They're Molly's. Oh. Whoa. Combat is super cool. Yeah, this is like. This reminds me of um. Is it Old Boy the movie? Where it's like the one long hallway and you just fight. They went nom nom on those suckers. <laughs> oh. Well, apparently when you get knocked out, you age. So that's Holy interesting. Shit. It's like a game I played. Um. Ashen. <laughs> I bet they're like, we're having fish tonight. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yo, this game is really cool. I'm, I'm really interested. Yeah. Very colorful. You're talking about Sifu? Sifu. 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 Seafood. That's what Chimera's fish had. <laughs> 2021. This that game's also very colorful. Of also Coming to the PS5 console later this year. Or well ahead. Now let's get an update. I feel like this was already. This was already. Solar Ash was yeah. It was announced. It's from Annapurna. Yeah, it said this is an update. Oh, there it is. I don't know how I'm so far ahead. There was a black hole from Interstellar. Porn. Sorry, do you have porn on the stream? That's my other tab, but I know you guys can see it. Apparently, Chimera can. Hey everyone. I'm Alex. I don't know if this game's for me, guys. I'm trying to be honest. Art Machine. I appreciate know us as a team Art Machine because they, they make um. Today I'm here to show you the first peek. Yeah, the game that I for our new title. Solar Ash. Can't, I really can't remember any names, but they're good. Solar Ash good. is a huge, stylish 3D platformer focused on speed, <laughs> movement, and fluidity. The game we is set not. inside a giant black hole known as the Ultra. Oh, you bought Phasmophobia, right? Nice. Everything in its path. We do not. Yeah, you yeah play I as Ray, keep hearing stuff about this game. Runner. Who's the decided to venture into this terrifying anomaly the, the as a last ditch yeah. effort to save her home yeah. Keep hearing about Ray it. is extremely agile, able to speed across the world with No, unfortunately I'm a, I'm a fearless man, so I, I don't have such phobias. Quickly cover great distances hmm. in our huge world. At its core, Solar Ash is a game about movement, and Ray has everything she needs to flow through the dangerous and unique. Is this just like a crazy platformer? Because I don't know yeah, if, that's, if that's the case. I love platformers. 
you hear that Sony is going to release a bunch of games for PC soon? Yep, I did hear that. With, uh, starting with, well, so they had, they had Horizon last year. And Death Stranding was also last year. And then Death, that Days Gone is going to be the first one, yeah. Ooh, I want to play Death Stranding. As you, you want to be a, uh, enemy encounters will a UPS driver? UPS, yeah. Some of these creatures I will say that I, I started playing timing. Death Stranding and like couldn't put it down for a while. Mm -hmm. Like it, it's it's I like really weirdly addicting. It's a, I mean, it's a Kojima game. It has a weird. If, if it sinks, it's if, if you're let it sink its hooks into you. It's hard to, eventually need to face the massive go of. of this void. Mm -hmm. Wretched. I had the freaking album on loop, quest. man. Yeah, I had a really album good album. Great. For only one minute. That's not enough time. You don't even. I'm like three hours into that game and I don't even know what's happening. So you definitely don't know what's happening. <laughs> I finished that game and I don't know what's happening. <laughs> <laughs> nah, it's a pretty cool story. Heart Machine's vision of the adventure platform. Now make up a tea, that's fair. With, with Troy movement, Baker as the villain. Of combat mm -hmm. and the high stakes that's why I street played the top. it. Enormous beasts all come yeah, together to bring players something Troy we Baker. think is incredibly yeah, unique. And, and Leo Sedo's in it too. Fun. Who's that? This game He's, is a labor um, of love. For everyone on the heart machine, it's like team. the Bond girl in the last two Bond movies. PS5 I don't PS4 like this one. Later this year, made some mad tasty chocolate. Ooh, chocolate Ooh chip cookies. I want chocolate chip cookies. It's interesting that they keep saying 2021 and they're not giving actual games? dates. I feel like that's what this whole thing would be like about. I don't like this next game. Mm -mm. I'm still is ahead. It? I don't like it. When this mm -mm. Found this FNAF? You were I think it's. It looks almost like it's you were small, Five Nights at Freddy. Okay, pathetic. yeah. That's what I just said. I said it's just FNAF. Oh, what did you say? Nah, Five Nights at Freddy's. What he's saying? Like, oh, I don't. I've never heard that. Dude, I'll take some chocolate chip cookies. If you're offering. Oh, I want some. Put, put them up to your screen, and Austin will say goodbye. <laughs> there it is. Ow! When fear hold takes hold. So I played through uh, Five Nights at Freddy's two last week, and. I've come to the decision that I don't like Final Fantasy Freddy's game. Yeah, no. I don't like I don't like I was never that big of a fan. Especially the I first four. I played this one with my friend, because she really liked them. Together. Like, the and first game's it. cool, right? Like, like for what it was, right? And then they, cool they, they well, milk is, it this seems like it's games. different. Yeah, this because is the other ones you stay in a security room, right? Yeah, this seems like an actual... Well, I think what happened was, after Final Fantasy Freddy's 4, um... He, There's like... He's taken other people, like he's taken other studios, to. But I have an emotes. Emotes are still there. Yeah. We can still only have one. We can't get more until we have 15 subscribers. Yeah. Um. Oh yeah. So he's been hiring other studios, from what I understand, to make other games in this universe. But I think that's what this, I think that's what's happening here. But I could be wrong. Scott could be making this game himself. I mean, this looks like a security breach. Yep. This, this they, they looks like this, it's better than the other. Well, they place. announced this during last mm -hmm. uh, PlayStation Showcase. You right. But that was just like, oh, they showed one. like random, they didn't show gameplay that first time we seen. Oh, they look, PS5 it. too. Uh -huh. that was a I mean, that's, what, that's what I'm saying. They, they announced it during the Play, PlayStation 5 show. We're watching the PlayStation stream. I don't know if you're watching. I am too. Up next, oh wait. Let's take a tour of Odd oh, Oddworld Soulstorm. What happened? Hi, I'm Lauren. Was she Lander, watching the wrong thing? Oh, no. I she was on IGN, so maybe IGN. they were faster. There. Tour uh, of our newest game, Oddworld Soulstorm. There we go. Maybe I'll be closer now. Do you know why you have? In Soulstorm, you reprise the role of like, a Like, shut mouth hero always disturbs me. I don't know why. An emerging revolution. As you I've never do played an odd world game. Weird and wonderful but I've always heard good things. To yeah, me either, but same thing here. And eternally greedy that guy definitely looks. looked like someone from Star Wars. We really wanted to bring this mm -hmm. world to life for sure, what we call 2.9D platforming, which adds much more depth and immersion for the player. Did you say 2.9D platformer? This is also reinforced <laughs> through the use of the dual senses haptic feedback, as you'll now be able to you can feel his heartbeat with the haptic feedback. And suspenseful <laughs> situations. Wow. There are well over 1,000 fellow Mudokans that you must try to save along the way. But they are far more than helpless workers looking to be saved. 
When used effectively, harness you'll their be energy? able to solve puzzles, harness their combined <laughs> energy, and be given the tools they need to fight alongside you. And there will be times when the extra hands will be needed as you face off against an array of heavily armed enemies that will stop at nothing to find and end Abe once and for all. Nothing In order about. to stand a chance Good against content. this much larger threat, we gave Abe the ability <laughs> to scavenge, loot, and pickpocket items from his surroundings mm. and use them to craft an impressive arsenal of his own. I'm not a big fan of games like others. this. These platformers, you can also but the last one that played that pacifist or an agent of chaos. I really like his battle to toads, the one that came out last year. But there is mm. one battle toads was really, really for our shamanic like, to the point where I was not expecting it to be. This mystical yeah, I remember power you really allows you to it. take control of your foes and use their strengths and I'm weapons still playing against Ori. them. I need to finish it. I know I suck at it so much, so I keep like not wanting to play. <laughs> The odd world universe is the first play. place, and this means that there are some environments and situations that require a little more thought, patience, and stealth. You'll find dark and dangerous caves, heavily guarded industrial sites, and ancient forgotten lands. Here, we've built lots of opportunities for you to test your skills and find different ways to handle things. It won't be easy. If being hunted by an army backed by a shady and wealthy organization isn't bad enough, there are also I definitely more reminds dangers you of in the form of it natural is. obstacles, oh, ancient traps, trials against yeah, the, no, the dark, bad guys, an industrial hazard. Looks like a general from Star Wars, I'm pretty sure. And avoided. Ultimately, Star Wars, but I'm Abe's something else. Oh, look, there you go, Alexa. Uh, it's still disturbing to me. There's a rich and engaging narrative to discover in a world full of lies, and we've been able to bring yeah. our characters to life like never before. In true Oddworld fashion, your actions in game will decide the fate of Abe and all those you manage to liberate along the way. And we can't wait to see what you will do. Oh, oh, uh, what, is, what is this? Four? Fourth game? Oh, where? First date, April 6th. PlayStation. Is this I'm coming to PlayStation? So that means I'm uh, getting. Oh, no, it's been, it's been on for a while, Alexa. You're not. I think you're uh, How is the latest on Oddworld oh. Soulstorm? I feel like that's also that, going to come out that's that's April, That's April's PlayStation Plus. Oh. Oh. Version for oh. No oh. Extra cost starting there you in go. PS5 version for no extra cost starting so in April. after Destruction All-Stars is out, Oddworld Moving Soulstorm on. is in. Time to catch oh my god, it's this game. I, I, this game looks really good. I saw on the June PS5 showcase. Ooh. Yep, that's exactly whatever. I'm already sold. The second I have that first shot. <laughs> Bugs next. That's okay. so cute. Yo, did you see the new news about Bugsnax? About what like, the original ending was and stuff? No. Yeah, apparently they had a whole different ending and like the whole mechanics of the end game. The end game was different. I'll I'll read up on that later. This reminds me of like Pixar animation, like the style of it. I can see that. The new um hey guys. trailer for the new Pixar movie came out today. Oh, which one? Luna. <gasps> Ooh, I'm excited about that. I'm gonna go watch it. But yeah, this game, <clears throat> since it was announced in June, I've had my eye on it. Really go. Ooh, do you think we're gonna see anything about Project Athena? Oh, <clears throat> I almost forgot about that. I, that. That's definitely that's true. I did not think that, of that. That that would be interesting. I would love to hear more about that game. There's also the other one. What was that? Like Death Stranding. It's from Capcom. You know what that's called? Mm, not that I remember off the top of my head. It was, it was at the same conference that they had uh, Project Athena in. Man, I can't. Stupid name. I have like a space mascot, like dude with a had like an astronaut suit. Are you sure you're not thinking of Eternal? Trapped no. Spirit. Yeah, but there's yeah, no. It's this is from Capcom. Tangled in the tragedies of our past. Apparently, I can't think of any names today. We got third time. <laughs> I couldn't think of a name. But yeah, this but is this, game this is very Pixar-ish. Yeah, this game yeah. looks great. Look, look at that! Oh man, I but love the look of it. I want to play it. It seems like it would be fun gameplay too. Yeah, mm -hmm. for sure. Little Groots, you gotta kill little baby Groots. <laughs> Cool. Me, like, I guess it's just being like a P Disney animation movie. Uh, it has like kind of Pixar y style, but it, I feel like if it was a movie, it'd be a Disney animation. So, so I'm pretty sure this game just got delayed too. Ooh. 
must move Who's on. Who's called Kenna? Kenna Bridge of Spirits or something. Oh. Oh well, there's the end. Spoiler alert. Oh. Like so it. This <laughs> is like, like a. Guy is so cute. <laughs> it seems like it's yep. almost. Ooh, August twenty fourth. That's not. That's not too far. No. I think it was supposed to come out this time of the year, and it got delayed to August. Mm. Now let's settle in for a stylish new look at Death oh, First-person shooter. PS5 first there person is. shooter developed by the team at Arcane. I, I should have. Oh, I should have guessed Death Loop. I forgot about this game. Yeah. It's funny because if you buy this game, I can actually play it now. Yeah. Um, it's funny because if you play this, if you buy this game, and you put it on PlayStation Five, you enter it. The first thing you'll see, the Microsoft Studios logo. I'm pretty sure uh, MLB just came out on. Uh, yeah, on Xbox. On Xbox too. <laughs> MLB the show. I can say that this game looks like it'll be fun, mm -hmm. but I'm not gonna buy it. I saw, um, I went to GameStop yesterday, and I saw that they had, it's called the Arcane Collection, and it's $60. And let me tell you, it's such a fantastic deal, because it comes with uh, Dishonored 1, Dishonored 2, and uh, Dishonored DLC is called the Outside Death of the Outside or something like that. Mm -hmm. And uh, Prey. Hmm. It's a very uh, James Bondish entrance. Yeah, I was about to say this music is very. Yeah, oh, hundred percent. That, that's exactly what this was. They even say the title in the song. Yeah. And look at those bullets flying and stuff. That's so James Bond to Hourglass. Oh yeah. Uh, yep. Go ahead, but we'll roll with it. I don't know how. Now I'm on PlayStation. <laughs> this seems interesting. I feel like I'll die a lot. I think it'd be a fun game to like stream. I mean, that's the point of the game, though, is to die over and over again. Yeah. yeah. Then you learn. Damn. What a. <laughs> What a gangster move, going into a room, well, dropping a grenade, powers. and just... Yep, Somebody's that's the, like, thing. Like, that's what, like, Dishonored 1 and 2, a lot of these mechanics that you're seeing right now are from Dishonored. Like, the mm -hmm. teleportation is straight up Dishonored. Like, that's... I wouldn't be surprised if you just, like, copied and pasted it and meant, yeah, let's change the colors. The song is so James Bond style, it's crazy. Oh, yeah, I can, I can hear the DMCA's coming already. <laughs> I will say it's weird whenever I see these kind of things and like someone's shooting and their face remains like the animation just remains blank. Mm. Like a dead dead pan while they're shooting. Kind of freaks me out. Song's over, people. Ooh. And so is Ramblin' Frank. The rest there of you motherfuckers are next. Yep. Die, die again. Flash Arcane Leon presentation. If at first you don't succeed, die and die again. <laughs> Before we leave, oh, how about a like a... huge update for one of 2020's most celebrated Horizon? games? Wait, no, as you said, uh, Final Fantasy. Fantasy. Oh, there's rumors that this is going to be the PlayStation Plus game this month. That's, I mean, April. Oh, yeah? Right? Yeah. Yeah, it's been rumored that this is going to be the one of the games. Which is crazy because I'm so to finally actually play it because I have not played a Final Fantasy game. Mm. I've never played one. Neither have I. And I've been told that if you're going to play one, play seven. Yep. Mm. A touching reunion. Well, guys, your girl finally made it to Midgar. But I think this could also just be like a PlayStation 5 version of the game. That's what. Yeah, but they can be doing both. Oh, for sure. My 
like they just did with uh, uh, Oddworld. Hunter and elite special forces operative for the new Wu Tai government. Alright, here's here's my enemy. thing, right? That I think that they're doing Members PlayStation's doing this like PlayStation Plus this. thing to try to Back. get people. It's kind of like yeah, balancing are. against Someone's Game Game Pass. What yeah. took you? Like, Sorry about that. And what? Like, anyway, why would they nice need to, to have Oddworld come out as a PlayStation Plus exclusive? Unless they were like. Right? Skeptical that'll well, do well. Of course it will. No, it's not exclusive. Well, oh, no, I mean, I mean, sorry, I meant like it's gonna come out for free. Like you don't have to pay for it if you have a PlayStation Plus subscription. Like why would you go out like, like death? I think just um, to yeah get more people to join it. Like Destruction All Stars, I can understand because it was originally gonna be seventy dollars, which people weren't too excited about, and then it got delayed as well. And like it's a nice way of being like, hey, we there's some bad news, but he's also some good news with it. Um. Plus, you know, you'll need PlayStation Plus anyway, because it's a, you know, paying for the game, so you have to have, like, online capacity. But this game, like, Oddworld doesn't make any sense for why they just throw it in for the membership. Yeah, Oddworld has, like, a big cult following to it. Probably just to get people to join PS Plus, yeah. And plus, they, they probably thought about it, like... What other game are you gonna put up there for a PS5, PS Plus game, without losing too much money? Yeah. Whatever it is they're planning. And if they do this game too, like I, I feel like that's the nail in the coffin. Like, that's like well, not the nail in the coffin. That's like the drives the point home. Of, like, that's exactly what's going on. Yeah, because they'd be literally giving out a game of the year nominee for free. Fantasy Seven Remake, Intergrade. Global so, Worldwide, June 10th. Begin. There's some more. Get down here, Bert. I mean, there's part two coming out, too, I'm guessing. Oh, uh, and then PS5 upgrade. Oh, this is cool how they're doing it. Reference on PlayStation 5. Ooh. This looks, I mean, it just looks nice and crisp on the PlayStation 5. More realistic lights. That let nice lens flare in. Mm -hmm. Do what you want. Final Fantasy games look fantastic. Oh, yeah. At least the new ones, I can't speak. I mean, the old ones are good. This and 15 are just like really, really good. I should cut my hair like her. The girl with the braids. Oh, yeah? Spikes. Really showing off this graphical showpiece. Yeah. I mean, this is probably their big thing. Outside of Horizon, which is probably We're at 30 going to be minutes, the end. Oh wow, maybe this is the end. No Horizon. Quality of life. Wow, really <laughs> taking the time with these. Hmm. Loading times, yes, the, the game will have loading times as well. Like what a really weird tech, what. You should at least say, like, better loading times, or faster loading times. Why would you just say loading times? Ooh, look at this photo mode yeah, screen. I know, I know. I'm a little, a little excited, right? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh, keep going. New episode featuring Goofy? Goofy? I don't know, I don't know what I'm, I don't know who the character is. Just do it. Yep. Oh, Fantasy 7 Remake. Intergrade. Oh, same title. PlayStation 4, PlayStation 5. If you want to copy the PlayStation 4 version, upgrade the PlayStation 5 for free. You're you can carry over the same data. Over. But will prefer purchase after upgrading the PlayStation 5 version. Worldwide. 2020, 2021. 
That was the yeah, so that's not a, Final Fantasy VII not a, not a PS Plus Interbook, title. Coming to the PS5 console oh, later yeah. this year. There we go. Wow. And yeah, that was quick. that's our show. Whoa, we hope okay. you're as excited as we are for what's to come no horizon. in 2021. Wrong. See you next time. Mm -hmm. hmm. See, I've uh, got nothing right, except for that no God of War was mentioned. Well, I mine wasn't really, I didn't I think got, mine was going to happen. I just hoped it would, so I'll just remain disappointed. I'll take Returnal. I swore that. Among Us was gonna, was gonna yeah, make that would have made sense, but well, um, I want to play Among Us. We should get four other people and play Among Us. Or what's you're, you need seven, isn't it? Or no, is it nine? I don't um, know. Whatever it is, you can do as many as you want. Yeah, oh, so we should get other friends. <laughs> but um, that was pretty uh, un uh uninteresting. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I was like, yeah, it was fine. I'm not going to say it was, it was bad. It was about equal excitement I had during Nintendo 1, not going to lie. I mean, yeah, Nintendo was, was better. Yeah, because at least it surprised me with Mario Golf. Yeah, it was like Mario Golf. And, <laughs> and me like, too. This was like, obviously, like, I knew, I, I said at the beginning, there's no announcements as far as we know. It's like dates on stuff that we've already had or already knew about. It's just like... Other than, I guess, maybe the fact that Odd World was coming to PS Plus and that Returnal, no, not Returnal, uh, uh, Kina Bridge of Spirits has a release date now because I don't think that was known before. Um, I don't think there's really anything here that's like, oh, like I'm so excited. <laughs> you know yeah. I mean? And I don't know, like, the fact that they didn't show it here, uh, Horizon, I mean, the fact that they didn't mm -hmm. show Horizon here either means that there, it's not a Q one or two q2 2021 game and that it's going to come out like much like later in the year or they're going to have like you know in next month they're going to be like hey here's another state of play but this one's only for horizon zero or horizon forbidden west you know like the one they did yeah. for last of us mm -hmm. but i don't think that i don't think they would do that because i think they'd have to have like a good lead up to the game like a good like few months of being like hey here's the hype for it here's like what's gonna happen and that kind of thing yeah i'm surprised i'm surprised there was nothing mm -hmm. and i think more so i don't think that god of war is gonna come out this year i know they announced it for 2021 we've heard such little about it and i mean it could yeah, i feel be, like it's gonna get pushed to it could still be december you don't know yeah it could, that's, that's the thing. You it could how, be december right how much realistically they've done how much is different is it a completely different map? Is it like mm -hmm. there's there's so much that could well, go I, into? I feel like it's going to be a different map. I feel like it's going to be a different like you know it's a whole new kind of story, same characters. But I think it's more like the more so the reason why I say it is like if if they unless they had to, you wouldn't put two games just right back to back. Like obviously they did it with um, Last of Us Part Two and Ghost of Tsushima coming out with within a month of each other. But that's because like Last was had to get kept getting delayed and delayed until it was like eventually they either you know they had to push it back right before or I guess they could have pushed Ghost but it wouldn't have made any sense to do so. Um, both both game of the year worthy. Oh yeah, for sure. Um, I don't. Th I feel like God of War is just a little too far off, and with you know everything that's going on with COVID, I think it's just like it's. I wouldn't be surprised if that game got pushed back because it's just they're not far enough. In. You know, I, I feel like that teaser was just like a little too. There, there was nothing there. That's what I'm trying to say. Like the teaser had nothing to show for it other than like an animation, the logo, and the title. Yeah, and then like voiceover. And so like I don't think there's going to be enough done to be warranted here. Um, and if PlayStation had the choice, they'd probably be like, "Hey, well, we have one exclusive here, or one big exclusive this year." Is Horizon. Well, I mean, Horizon obviously is closer to being done than God of War is. Yep, exactly. We've seen Horizon to a limited extent where God of War, we got God of War Ragnarok and then the yep. voiceover. That's it. So I don't think I don't know. That's my thoughts, but um that that was that was that. Let me know what you guys thought um down in the comments. And of course follow us on Twitch where we'll we will be still live. We're gonna be live after this chatting a little bit as, as well, but um want to hear the chats then uh go to twitch you guys have anything else to say we we'll wrap it up for the youtube people bye